Hi, Marco here. Let's see how we can integrate Team City and GitHub. And there's actually a couple of integrations you can choose from, so let's go through them one by one. For that, go to your project or rather your build configuration, edit it, go to the build feature section, click add new build feature, and then choose the commit status publisher. It's the first integration you can choose, essentially meaning that Team City, after build has happened, it will send the information if the build was successful or if the build succeeded to GitHub and that will be displayed on github.com then. And I'll show you how that looks like in a second. For that, just choose your VCS route, then choose GitHub from the publisher section. You can leave the GitHub URL as is and then you'll need to paste in your personal access token in here. You can test the connection, the connection was successful, simply hit save and you're good to go. The commit status publisher is one integration. The second one will be the pull request integration. If you're working with pull requests and GitHub, I actually have another video here in the learning center, which you should watch, which explains that integration in detail. That is number two. The third integration is GitHub also has an issue tracker. And what you can do is integrate with that issue tracker as well. For that, step to your project, not the build configuration, click issue trackers, create a new connection, then choose the connection type, GitHub, put in a display name like my personal GitHub issue tracker, the repository URL, paste in the link, not to the issues, but rather just to the repository. Authentication is again, your access token. I'm just gonna paste in my access token in here. The issue ID on GitHub is always a hash and a number. So I'm going to test the connection. I know issue number three exists because I dele deleted the first two. So that should work. Summary is 42 still the answer. Yes, that looks fine. I'm just going to create the issue tracker connection. Now, when I go to my project and then not just run a new build, but rather go to github.com and I already prepared a file which I'm going to commit. In a commit message, you can see that I'm referencing the issue number three with just some text behind it, demonstrating the GitHub integration. I'm just gonna commit the new file. You can see GitHub test.txt, now it's there. We're gonna go back to Team City. It already picked up the change and we're gonna wait for the build to happen. Right, the build has finished successfully. Let's open it up. When you scroll down, you can already see here's your change section where there's a hyperlink Referencing issue number three, when you open it up in a new tab, you'll be directed straight to the issue on GitHub, right? I got it, that's fine. You can even see that the commit here is verified and the build was successful because it has a green check mark, right? You can even click details here and it will be brought right back into Team City into the builds overview page. So the integration works both ways. That's about it, bye.